I'm Stephen Tremaine. And I'm Amy Tremaine. We're Two Swine Crew. And today we're cooking... The Dutch Oven Chicken Outcast and Potatoes. The thought behind the dish is we often have a lot of leftover chicken thighs from competition that we don't end up bringing with us to the contest. They're the wrong size or the wrong shape or just plain ugly. <laughs> so what we do is we remove the skins for them and we use this in this real simple dish that sometimes we can make on Friday night before a contest or even at home. Today we're going to cook it in a Dutch oven on B&B briquettes. Um, we like to use briquettes on these Dutch ovens. In this case, in this Dutch oven, I'm using a different method because it's one with claws on the bottom, which is usually used to cook on the ground or even on a fire. Um, but sometimes that's not practical. Bending over sometimes isn't very fun. So we've kind of created a way to cook it on top of a grill and using the grill really as a table or a stand. And uh, it's much easier on the back, it's easier to use, and it makes this Dutch oven much more flexible. What we like to do is light a chimney of briquettes. When they get up to temperature, typically I'll take about 12 or so and put them up underneath to get started. So about half, a couple more right there. Keep the others to the side, because we're gonna use those in a few minutes. We put that in a full pan. Use the grill as a table, put it underneath, and now we can bring our oven up to temperature. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do is we're going to, um, we're gonna put the bacon on. Now while the bacon's cooking, we'll go ahead and season up our chicken. Just use whatever your favorite uh, chicken rub is. We have the uh, Cosmos Dirty Bird. Now that the bacon is cooked through, sometimes you may want to drain a little bit of the grease. And now you just start adding the rest of your ingredients. Uh, celery and onions. Diced potatoes. It's all pretty. And then we have our favorite barbecue sauce. Now after it's all added, we'll replace the lid. You want to take your remaining 10, 12 charcoal, people, their cats charcoal, put them, kind of distribute them evenly on the top of this lid. Let that sit. And in about 45 minutes, it should be ready. Now that it's been about 45 minutes, let's take a look and see if this is ready. Oh, yes. oh yeah. Okay. Looking good. Let's bring it over here and get ready to plate it. Set right here. So we have our Dutch oven chicken outcast potato dish. It is done, it is looking fantastic. So we're just gonna go ahead and move it from the Dutch oven over to the plate. Don't forget that bacon. 
Oh, I'm not gonna forget the bacon. That's my favorite part of this dish. So it's gonna be a little bit soupy. So I like to try to scoop it out first and then kind of drizzle the excess on top. We like hearty meals in our family. So that is it. This is our Dutch oven um, bone-in skinless chicken thighs. We have potatoes in here as well. Um, we call it our outcast because it's kind of all of the outcast chicken thighs that don't necessarily make it into the competition <laughs> box. Um, but it's a great meal. It has a great flavor. It has all kinds of things going on. We have bacon in here. We have the chicken thighs. We have potatoes. We have celery. We have onions. We have barbecue sauce. So it's a really great meal and it's super easy to do. Just one, one pot right in the Dutch oven.